Welcome to my channel. This is Mrs. A of Math A Matic. Today's video is about graphing linear equation using any two points, the x-intercept and the y-intercept, or the slope and a point on the line. Now, before we're going to proceed, please don't forget to subscribe to my channel, share my videos, and like if you like it. Now, let's graph linear equation using any two points. So, I already have uh, values here, assigned value for x. I need only two uh, points here in order to determine a line. So, I assigned only two values of x. So, 0 and 3. So, why I choose 0 and 3? Why not 0 and 1? Because I want my points to be quite far from each other. So, now, you can choose any point anyway. So we have now 2x plus 3y is equal to 9. So I'm going, I'm going to use now 0 to re, uh, replace here instead of x. So 2 times 0 plus 3y is equal to 9. Then that is 0 plus 3y is equal to 9. And that is 3y is equal to 9. So we want to solve for y. So what we are going to do is divide both sides by 3. And this one, 3 divided by 3 is 1. Or you can simply... Cancel that one. So 9 divided by 3 is 3. So y is equal to 3. So I can write it here. Now the next one is 3. So 2 times 3 plus 3y is equal to 9. And that is 6 plus 3y is equal to 9. So 3 again. So what I'm going to do first is y, uh, 3y here because... We need to get rid of 6 and we need to add negative 6 on both sides of the equation. So this would be 0. And that would be 3y left here. And 9 minus 6, that is 3. That is addition property of equality. Now, we need to divide both sides by 3 to solve for y. And this is again 1. 3 divided by 3 is 1. And 3 divided by 3 also on the other side is 1. So y is equal to 1. So I'm going to write it here. So I have now two points, 0, 3, and 3, 1. I can now plot these points on Cartesian plane. Now, first point 0 is x and y is 3. So from the origin, which is 0 here for x, I'm going to go up for 3, 3 units, that is 2, 3. So the point should be there, okay? And that's the coordinate of that is 0, 3. Next is 3, 1. So again, x is 3. So I'm going to find it here on the x-axis. That is 3. And then 1, I'm going up again because it's positive. So that is here. That's my second point. And the coordinate of that is, I mean, yes, 3, 0. The ordered pair, 3, 0. Now, Next is simply connect these two points. And this is now the graph of 2x plus 3y is equal to 9. Okay, so next is, so now let's graph linear equation using its intercepts. When we say intercepts, that's the x-intercept and the y-intercept. What do you mean by x-intercept? The x-intercept is a point wherein the graph crosses the x-axis. And the y-intercept is a point wherein the graph crosses the y-axis. So that's what we're going to look in order to um, so a graph. So the given now is 3x minus 2y is equal to 6. So we're going to solve for the x-intercept and the y-intercept. If you want to solve for x-intercept, we are going to let y is equal to 0, which means that instead of writing y here, we're going to substitute that to 0. So we have 3x minus 2 times 0 is equal to 6. 3x, 2 times 0, that is now 0. So 3x is equal to 6. Now divide both sides by 3. And x now, 3 divided by 3, that is 1. So x is equal to 2. 6 divided by 3 is 2. Okay, so the point now is 2, 0 here. Okay, now, for the y-intercept, we need to let x is equal to 0, and then substitute that 0 to x. So, 3 times 0, 
minus 2y is equal to 6, 3 times 0 is 0, so we have now is negative 2y is equal to 6. And we can now divide both sides by negative 2 to solve for y. And that is now, this is 1, y now is equal to negative 3. And the point now is 0, negative 3. So this is very easy to graph. Because you just go, x-intercept is 2, which means on the x-axis, that is 2. That's it. And then, for this another other point here, for the y-intercept, negative 3, which is here in the y-axis. And this is negative 3, so you just plot that point. And the coordinates of that is 0, negative 3. And then after that, just connect the point. I mean, yes, to determine a line. Okay? So that's how you're going to graph linear equation using its uh, intercepts. Now, graphing linear equation using its slope and a point on the line. So given now is one point and the slope. Okay, so the slope is two-thirds. And the point is negative 3, negative 2. If we are given the slope 2 third here, we can use the formula of slope which is rise over run. Which means the rise is 2 and this is positive, it means going up. And the run is 3, the run, the run is also positive which means going to the right. So this is now the Cartesian plane. So this is now um, simply first is to plot this point that is x is negative 3, and then y is negative 2. So, going down 2 units. Okay? So, that's the point. The first point there. Okay? Then, after that, so that's negative 3, negative 2. So, we're using the slope now. You're going to rise for 2 units. So, 1, 2. And then, a run for 3, 1, 2, 3. That ended up at the origin, the second point, at 0, 0. And then connect the two points. So that's the graph of a line that passes through negative 3, negative 2, and has a slope of 2 thirds. So that's how you're going to graph linear equations. It depends on the given. So thank you for watching and see you on the next one. Bye-bye.